Okay, what we have here is our first tube experiment since 1972. I was about 12 years old when I was trying to put a television together, tube television, from kit. I realized I ran out of some major parts and I gave up. Also studying the tube electronics catalog. And that's as long ago as I messed with the tubes. Anyhow, what we have is an EL84. It's popular with the uh, some of the guitar amps, and you can still buy this tube. It's still in production. It's the uh, what is it? The six Bravo Quebec five equivalent tube. What we have is a uh, line filter from a microwave oven transformer. We've got a 6.30, 6.3 transformer from uh, Radio Shack, three amps running the filament and you can see the filament is it's definitely warm don't want to put your finger on that thing that's been running for about 10 minutes so anyhow what we did we've got the uh, 9 pin socket uh, you see that we soldered some wires in and soldered it into the board put some screws to hold the base off the uh, circuit board this is just a breadboard plexiglass covers bolted to anyhow the test results we've got here this is the schematic uh, we've got the heater hooked up one goes to ground uh, so the 6.3 one half of the uh, secondary fires up the uh, filament then we were testing the uh, different points here. This is test point two, test point three, test point four and five, and ground was six, test point one over here, the unused side. So we were uh, seeing what the electron flow was as it was just idling here. And these are the results. Tubes warmed up for at least 60 seconds. We also did a uh, an amp check on the filament it was about 0.8 amps that was pin four to five and the uh, these are the other results we've got here again these are the uh, test point call out you get test point one two three four five and six this is the uh, grid number one this is grid number two three is also hooked to the cathode and then we get the plate up here is test point number four yes. we use the uh, Klein CL 200 meter to check all the uh, voltage in the amp reading. And this is a JJ Electronics EL84 tube by the way. So there you have it.